mother of two boys. Who died of excessive bleeding and multiple blunt force trauma injuries. With reports indicating that she may have been killed by her husband. The suspect being her husband who is missing as we speak. Currently the suspect is at large but as a government we are pursued to see them which is arrested. Steve, so, so, Akanijua leo. Nda mwenisha kuwa mimi, pia mimi mwanaumu. Hata hizi kazi sitafu. Yacha ni kape stress kwa maazi. Man, I'm just tired of making sense of Cause I still love you I do Ah, Gloria. Hey, Maish, mambo. Uwa, kumingi. Sili ya disalamu, usalimi watu. Ah, manje, si, boy, manje. Niku haso, tu. Adis patangi, tayo. Oh, lakini uko poa? Eh, si, tu, uko tu. Siva, ni kwa job. Oh. So, ada sa iti na kwa 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 kwa
victim of home-based violence has been found dead in a house in Kanolini. The victim, identified as Gloria Modoni, was stabbed in the back by the boyfriend. The deceased body has been moved to the city mortuary, awaiting for post-mortem as the police continue their search of the suspect, Stephen Ochin, who fled the scene. Gloria's murder comes on the backdrop of escalating cases of gender-based violence since the start of the pandemic, with an increase of up to 92% from the previous years. We had members of the public to, to give information of his whereabouts. We also had our citizens to be vigilant and to indicate if there is any problem they should come to our offices or go to church because these cases are so many and we condemn them highly.